what's up guys it's me code welcome back to my channel and <laughs> today I'm gonna be showing you some um, a new awesome kind of trap I call it um, I call it a uh, rigged door trap now it's still a 1.11 trap it's more or less uh, still the same thing it's kind of undetectable no one can actually see it so if you go in here you just see dirt and Go from the sides, it's all dirt. And of course, there's nothing there, there's nothing there, you don't see anything at all. And you don't even see any redstone sparks. So yeah, this is plain house with the open gate. This gate could be um, locked with locket plugins in your server, or it just could be any kind of uh, land claims, but it wasn't included in the land claim, so we were able to uh, open it. Now in any case, without further ado, let's try going inside the inside the house. Whoa. <laughs> Run away. <laughs> well, this is basically it, guys. It's an exploding door. It's an exploding door trap. And the moment you activate it, you set up um, a chain reaction that actually devastated about this much. And the number of TNT I used for this kind of reaction was actually only 9 TNTs. So without further ado guys, I'm just gonna show you the videos before I keep, before I reveal all the secrets. So stay tuned. Okay, so for this build, we're going to be needing a um, house with a door. And uh, anything will actually do as long as there's a door here. So you're gonna be needing a door. And you have to make sure that no one can actually see into into the house from any kind of side. Sorry, someone's calling me. Now, aside from that, you're going to be needing an absorber block and some TNT. And yeah, that's basically everything you need. And again, I'm sorry guys. I haven't been making some videos lately because people have been bothering me from left to right. And it's just so hard to like get proper videos. So I have no choice but the video when everything's so noisy. And you know what, let's just turn off this music here. <laughs> it's it's not worth it right now. I think I'm okay with music as long as it's uh, low. But in any case, enough with the chit chat, I'm just gonna start. First you're gonna have to remove this door, go down. Do like this. Okay, now we're on a hole um, 3 blocks deep. This way we can already face our absorb block facing up. Next we're gonna place our door. Okay, good. <laughs> After that, we're going to have to set a perimeter of TNT. We're going to have to go like two blocks away. So basically, one here. And one over here. One over here. Over there. Now you may, you have to set the radius high because they could easily like see this and start running away. And and the place where they run is usually towards here or towards any of the sides. So you might wanna just make an area or just add a fence just so that they won't be able to escape the perimeter this there hide it over there get some plain dirt oops not the kind of dirt I'll be using this this that we're gonna cover it up like normal Darn, it's hard. <laughs> okay. We're gonna cover this up as well. <laughs> now guys, I would recommend doing something like this. Maybe we're gonna add like an oak fence here. 
and that. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna just do this, okay? We want them to like um. Something like this. And then you just gonna leave this open. Put like um, a claim sign. If you have locket, you gotta put a locket sign here. Put private, name, whatever. And then you just simply leave it open. Now, make sure the area is in claim. You just put um, that stuff. And that's simply it. You could make like another door here in which you're just gonna add the um the same thing, you just need an observer block and some other and you know and more TNTs. Now you could set up the entire area with TNTs or you can just make it like every other block there's TNTs, but you just need like um to make it go off perfectly in a chain reaction, you just need like a two block distance. So bear that with my in mind. So once everything's over, we're going to have to close the door first. Um, seal up this. We're going to have to seal that up. Break this. Okay. Cover that. Cover that back up. Leave the leave the front porch open, and the house is good to go. This is basically it folks, so yeah, it was quite simple to build and <laughs> I know a lot of you were like more interested in some um, bear builds, though I don't think um, undetectable is kind of like um, being able to see observer blocks on the ground, but you kind of won't see it, I guess, <laughs> in any case. Yeah, this um, I wouldn't say it's completely undetectable. It's kind of like the same way you can detect traps as long as you're standing on top of a on top of like um a carpet. So yeah, you won't be able to you won't be able to completely say it's undetectable. And a side note, you can also set up the observer blocks from the sides, like behind the door, like something like this. Let's say this is the door. It opens like that, so you could set up an observer block right here. Oops. Eh, <laughs> so hard to place. Basically, you're just gonna. I'm just gonna do this here. You can set up an observer block there. You can like add the door frame. You can have like a door frame like this, and no one will actually suspect the thing. When you open it, people won't exactly see the block behind it directly. Then you're just gonna add like a hallway here. Nobody will see it. It's only when it's closed people can see it, and then this will activate whatever it is you want to trigger. So yeah, there are many, there are more than one ways to hide the observer block. You can just set it up to whatever position you wish. So yeah that's basically it for the tutorial i hope you guys enjoyed it and please leave a like and subscribe to my videos and stay tuned for more uh it's me code and i'll see you guys next time bye bye